afternoon, I'm Sonny Dixon, and this is the News Now. Right now, downtown Savannah, the sidewalks along Congress Street, packed since early this afternoon, still thronging crowds, everybody wanting a signature and a good look at the lady, the son, the famous Paula Dean family. This was not just any book signing at the Lady and Sons restaurant. Our good buddy Jamie Dean was signing copies of his first solo publication. It is called Jamie Dean's Good Food. Our Elizabeth Rollins drew the right straw. She spent a good portion of the afternoon. I'm talking about smack dab in the middle of all of it. Elizabeth, a lot of folks eager to see Jamie and, of course, his famous mama, Paula Dean. Yes, I mean, they're wrapping up right now as we speak, but they tell me hundreds came out today to see Jamie and get that book signed and as well see his mom. Now, this is Jamie Dean's first cookbook, and the line was wrapped around the building most of the day to get inside. Many folks walked away with several copies of the signed book. Some of us told us they were stocking up for Christmas, but it wasn't just about the book. Most people wanted the opportunity not only to meet Jamie and Paula, but the whole gang, including Paula's husband, Michael, and her other son, Bobby. I mean, you know, you see them on TV and stuff all the time. You never think you're going to get your picture took with them. So. And they're... They, you can't act that nice. You've got to be that nice to, to act that way, you know? You can't put on that show all the time if you're not really that way. Now Jamie has a new cookbook. What do you think? Well, we didn't really get a big chance to look at it yet, but it looks a lot healthier than what Paula would cook. <laughs> we'll give it a whirl. <laughs> And of course, everyone came out to see Jamie, but a lot of people were excited to see Paula since this is her first appearance in Savannah since those racial discrimination charges were dropped. Sonny? All right, I, I tell you what, I like what that gentleman from North Carolina said. It's hard to believe they're really that nice. They can't fake it. You know, those of us who've known them for decades know it is the real thing. And I just want to say to our audience, and I hope you'll confirm that. Uh, Nobody needs to look anywhere else because nobody got the access that WTOC did today. If you want to see what happened inside those doors, this is the place to be. Am I right? That's right. Coming up at 5, we actually sat down with Paula, so stay tuned. All right. Elizabeth Rollins, live on Congress Street at the Lady and Sons. Thanks very much. I want to take a live look at our website, WTOC.com. It's Lisa Lee. Move it a little bit so we can see it's live, Lisa. It is, uh, we have a lot of past stories on, there you go, past stories, all that's happened this year, there have been some awful, awful lows, followed, you know, of course, with the great highs, it's, but, but these are our neighbors, Paula Dean, Jamie Dean, the new cookbook is out, check it out, we're going to have so much more, you can read all that online, but you do not want to miss the news at 5 and 6. Now to some breaking news.